headed up to the birthday rehearsal. So we get to meet everybody, sound design, set design, all the actors will be there. I'm Bob Bennett, I'm the stage manager for the show. Thank you for being here. This is the uh, day when all things are possible. We're up on our feet, we're moving around. Lydia has given me uh, rewrites for a couple of the, of the scenes but only an effort to make things funnier, more exciting. You can tell everybody really wants to be here and really wants it to go incredibly well. The minute we got in the room, you could tell that this cast was the cast that was meant to be. I'm Dula Hill, and I play Kent Spoon. I am Condola Rashad, and I am playing Cheryl. My name is Tracy Toms, and I am playing Taylor Bradley Scott. My name is Makai Pfeiffer, and I play Flip. I'm Ruben Santiago Hudson. I play Joseph LeVay. My name is Rosie Benton, and I'm playing Kimber Davies in the new Broadway hit, Stick Fly. Feels like they're a family already, and we've just started. It has been an absolute joy. The time goes by too fast. Eight hours, six hours, 10 hours. It doesn't matter. It's just a, it's just a pleasure to be around them. They're eager, they're open, they're knowledgeable, extraordinarily talented, and willing, willing to take the chances that we need to take to make this a very successful play, and it will be. Everyone here wants to roll up their sleeves, you know, dig in and bring the best work to the stage. Everybody starts at the same table, no matter how large or small your role is, and then you have to organically build this piece. I actually have been doing a little rewriting, which has been kind of really a privilege. Lydia Diamond, exquisite. She's lovely, excellent writer. There's no ego involved. It's really just putting the best words that we can find on the page. Hearing us read it, you know, she's actually able to be like, oh, well, actually, I want it to be like this. You know what I mean? So we, we kind of play off of each other. She's telling a story of an African-American family that is not about drugs, not about families dealing with jail or murder. This is a play about family, exclamation point, period. Love is love, regardless of the color of your skin. Telling stories that nurture our lives, that inspire us, that bring us closer together, that's what I'm all about. So stick fly, that's what I'm doing now because that's the most important thing in my life. Kenny Leon. Fearless leader. Very passionate. Uh, visionary. He makes everybody understand that we are all stepping up to the plate and creating a piece of art. It's always great to have someone at the helm that you can trust, that you can take guidance from, that you respect. I think we have the best cast. We have cast that they are grounded, they have great comedic timing and a sense of timing, and also to have Alicia Keys on the creative team doing the music, you know, so I'm surrounded by beautiful, talented women. For doing the music, it is a, an interesting new process for me. I love that this is my first time doing it because it feels like there's nothing else to compare it to. The fact that she's decided to lend herself to this project means so much to me and says so much to me about who she is. And a lot of people were surprised. They're like, really, is it a musical? No, it's not. It's a really important story about a family who happens to be black. And she decided to put her name on this one. She could have done anything she wanted to do. It's such a delight to have a producer who's so invested in it, you know, and she, she's now taken on the role as being the composer. We started three days ago, and I've seen her every day because she's in there. I try to tap into the emotional part of it, and what does it feel like at these different moments in the play where music comes in. That's what I'd really like the music to do, just almost be its own character that maybe you don't notice it, but you feel it. I want audiences to be entertained, to be moved, to be challenged, and most of all, to be amused. I want the audience to laugh. I wanted to raise conversation and discussion, you know, and, and if it does that, then we've done our job. I think Stick Fly will give you two hours of special surprising moments that will add joy to your lives. A play about human beings, how they smash their ideas together and come out somehow still a family. My generation and, uh, and younger, um, maybe this wouldn't be the first place that they would go, you know, for entertainment. Because it's not quite something that we're taught is something we'd be interested in. And I, that's another reason why I love Stick Fly so much, because you will go here and you will feel like a part of this and you'll relate it back to what you already understand in your life. Alicia Keys comes in and says how we're all artists and how we're working together for that you know, moment on when the lights come up. It's just that excitement creates something and, and the audience will feel that. I hope that they feel invested in the LaVey family, that they go home and they say, I saw this play, it's called Stick Fly, it's crazy. I love it, like it really took me to a whole place and it reminded me of my dad or my sisters or my brothers or myself. I hope this play reminds the audience of themselves.